Time for more Good Day New York. Uh, by the way, vegan food, you into that? Vegan and vegetarian. Have you ever been to the Candle Cafe? Yes. I love this place. Yes, they yes, have a yes. new cookbook out for the holidays. And, and no meat. No meat. Oh, vegan. Greg, you need to go to the Candle Cafe. I've actually been there a couple of times. No meat. Now, I, quite frankly, enjoy meat very you much. You will not miss it when you go to the Candle Cafe. Uh, Several th locations. That's true. As a matter of fact, some of their food mimics meat, but it's not meat. Uh, what's that stuff called? You love that. I brought Satay. you some. All right. Satay. Let's meet our guest, please. Yes, it's me, Joy Pearson. She's a nutritionist and owner of the Candle Restaurants and Jorge Piñata. He's co-executive chef of the Candle Restaurants. Welcome to you both. Three locations in Manhattan. Three locations in Manhattan. And no meat. No I can't get over this. <laughs> what do you mean, light bulbs? <laughs> you will not miss anything. We actually know that you've been there, Greg, and you've been known to eat some seitan, so we brought you some. Oh, you, you did? did? Now, Joy, is this the new uh, cookbook? That's the new cookbook, Vegan Holiday Cooking from Candle Cafe. It's a compilation of recipes, plant-based recipes, of course. And by the way, for those who don't know, vegan means, okay, not only no meat, but nothing associated with any <laughs> animal, right? Any animal. No. What, now, is it a moral thing or is it a nutrition thing for you? For me, it's a nutrition thing. I'm a nutritionist by training, and for me, it's better for you better for the planet, and better tasting. Okay. It really, I have to say, your food is delicious, and you Thank know that you. we're there all the time. Tell us about some of the things that you brought us. What we brought you today is a tempeh, a pumpkin seed crusted tempeh with a Which cranberry orange relish, and a wild rice stuffing, and a roasted sweet potatoes with ginger and maple syrup. That's Looks a really hearty dish. Very hearty. And Greg, you know, we brought you this one to taste. What's this there? This one is a porcini crusted seitan. Now, if you look at this, it looks like it's veal. It looks like a veal color. <laughs> you know? I have to say, you know what I and love it too? That better, you... better, better, better. You know what I love that you do there too? Your black bean burgers. burgers. Hold on Those a second. Those are so good. That does taste just like meat. That's true. Really, there's not a little meat in there? <laughs> All right, very good. All right, so then you have little uh, a little Jesus. cocktail. This is actually a real cocktail. We have pico bars at all the restaurants. So cheers. No Greg, meat, but uh, too. plenty of alcohol. Here you go. And plenty of alcohol. Okay, fantastic. What's in here? All with a moral mission. <laughs> uh, Let's drink to that. Drinking to... All right. And, Chef, you're oh. going to make us something you today. You vegans yes. going to party. That's right. Yes, we're gonna make a cheesecake. We're a gonna cheesecake? Make, uh, what animal products normally go in a cheesecake? Uh, milk. Cheese. Milk. Oh, that's right, that comes with a cow. <laughs> and you should see the cover of the book. We've got all those cheeses there, and they're all made with nuts. Oh, that's fantastic. The cheese that he's making, though, is made with tofu. All, all right, right, Chef, let's make it. So we're gonna make the pumpkin cheesecake, and it's very three different uh, steps. We're gonna blend, bake, and decorate it. Go okay. ahead, go for it, pal. Tell All us right. the ingredients. This is uh, tofuri cream cheese. Okay. Tofu uh, cream cheese. Yes, yes. it's just tofu. So we're just gonna put it in there. Um, Silken tofu. And that's regular tofu. Yes, yes. just a little tofu. Remember um, when tofu first came out, I was like, wow, what is this stuff? Yeah. But now it's, uh, now it's not even that, you know. Yeah. We're gonna do a little nutmeg. Nutmeg, okay. We're going to make sure we put all the recipes uh, for this cheesecake. What's on that? The cinnamon? Website. Cinnamon? Vegan cinnamon. Vegan cinnamon. <laughs> cinnamon is always vegan. It's always vegan. Yeah. Uh, Stop confusing me. Yeah. <laughs> and the soy milk? That? Soy milk. Soy milk. That doesn't come. What does that come from exactly? A soybean. Soybean. Very yes. good. <laughs> Maple syrup. Maple syrup. That goes with a tree. That is not an animal. No. <laughs> well, I'm just Joy, I apologize. Yeah. Well, I'm this vegan thing He's is... been there, though, you know, Rosanna. Greg loves And this food. is agar agar. What's that? Agar. It's a thickening agent from seaweed. Okay, we mix that all up. Mix we it mix all it up. up. And we put it in the blender. And this is already it. blended in. And then we put it in the That pan. actually seems pretty simple. Yes. So simple. Yeah. You put it in here. Ooh, that looks good. Can and I, then can what I do taste you do? this part? Of course. Sure. Now you can taste this part too. Oh, that's good like that though. It's like <laughs> licking the bowl. Shall we? And I want to try the finished product. And you know, we're booked on every holiday, so this is, gives people a way to take this food home with them. I love it. All right, don't go anywhere, Joy. And uh, Chef, we'll be right back with the Candle Cafe. I don't miss the cow. Yeah. I don't miss the cow. <laughs> Oh, wow. that cheesecake hit the spot. It was good. It's Guilt. all in, and the recipes are in the Vegan Holiday Cooking book uh, from Candle Cafe. Joy, don't forget you can go see Joy at Powerhouse Arena at 37 Main Street, Brooklyn, October 1st from 7 to 9. Fant or go to her stores, three of them.
Again, you don't miss the uh, the dairy aspect of this. And it's guilt-free indulgence. Very nice. You know, I'm going to have yours, okay? <laughs> yeah, that's good. That's fine. <laughs> thank you so much. Hey, we want to thank, thank all you. Enjoy, Chef. Thank you so thank much. Thank you so much for having us. Dr. Roz and Mutembo. Mutembo. How do you feel?